five minutes with Phil is shot in front of a live studio audience. Hey everybody. <laughs> Welcome back to another five minutes with Phil. So we've been uh, plugging away hard at work today. Ooh. And um, because we realized, you know, there's two weeks until the big promise that we made, the big Land FM Slim Dusty birthday promise. And we looked at how much work we've got done and there was an astronomical amount that we'd already done, wasn't there, Phil? We'd done so much before we started today. So, um, yeah, we thought, better knuckle down, finish up, we'll get a few things done. So, uh, yeah, we did a little bit of a video recording for that planning session, so take it away. Transition sound. Phil, stop smiling at the camera. <laughs> We've got two weeks to get this Slim Dusty stuff ready. As of this morning, we had done no work on it. As of right now, we've got an intro and a song picked. We've got two weeks. And I found out that Slim Dusty would have been 95 years old this year. <laughs> oh boy, it was a hoot of a time, wasn't it, Phil? <laughs> so anyway, yeah, we've been plugging away, um, making sorry, that's just the Land FM guard dog. So anyway, yeah, we've just been, so anyway, <laughs> we've been plugging away and, um, yeah, we'll, we'll get that underway. It, sh it should most definitely be ready in time for, for Slim's birthday, shouldn't it? <laughs> And um, yeah, but well, and other things, we've been chatting a bit today. Um, Phil said to me he wanted to ask my opinion on something and I went into the blind horrors. Went, uh oh, he's asking me my opinion. Um, and yeah, we just, yeah, I'm really paranoid, Phil. Can I check that I hit record on the camera? Yeah, we did, we are rolling. <laughs> That would have been bad. Um, yeah, so yeah, Phil wanted to ask my opinion on something. And um, it was about a topic that came up last week. We discussed um, possibly... Um, so I just realised I didn't introduce this. This is Phil. I'm Chris. Um, yeah, I'm all over the place today. Yeah, we were talking about an, a, a trip around Australia. How, how would it work if Phil was to go on tour? and the logistics involved, what it would encompass, and where Phil would go, how long would he be away, how many, um, how many staff would Phil require for such an endeavour. And we didn't run the numbers because we didn't want to scare ourselves. So, <laughs> but I guess, I guess if, if anyone has a, um, a disability serviceable Winnebago that we could put Phil in um, for free with low mileage. I guess Phil would take it off your hands, wouldn't you? I reckon you would. Um, I reckon you would, wouldn't you, Phil? But yeah, no, we, we talked about how could we load Phil into a bus, have everything he needs, and do a big Australian tour like Slim cover over 48,000 kilometres in 10 months. And yeah, it was, it was a interesting hypothetical and I'd like to hear your thoughts on that. You know, give us a, give us a bit of a insight onto what you think w it would take to get Phil out there on a big national tour. Like, um, would you do the coast? Like right around Australia, the circumference? Like, Given Australia one big hug. Um, I'd love to be a part of that, Phil, but I think um, having a family it would be very hard on me and, and my family for to be away for that long. But I'm sure you've got some young, sprightly support workers out there who'd want to want to be on board for that. But yeah. Anyway, you give us uh, your thoughts on that one, and we will keep plugging away at this promised. Uh, slim Dusty thing. This is Chris saying goodbye. This is Phil smiling. 
and we will see you next week. Have a good one. See yous.